Now I can record. I'm recording from my phone, people. Uh, I guess you could call this a vlog. I don't know. I'm tired. You have to please excuse me. I'm so tired. Um. Yeah, I'm going to give you an update. Um, my main Facebook page, I have deactivated. I'm thinking about just completely deleting it. I, I have to, for real, Facebook has gotten ridiculous. I'm just like, it's, it's more, not just Facebook. It's like the whole social media platform. I don't get it. It's like, if you're not, if you don't have no drama going on, if, you, if you're not talking about uh, anybody and everybody, if you don't have money status and popularity, then people don't want to hear it, see it, experience it, whatever. Where has the world gone wrong at, you know? Um, I don't know, I'm just, maybe it's me, maybe I'm old fashioned, maybe, I don't know, but I know it's not for me. Uh, my thing here is this, for the millennials, as, as they say, let's start off with this kids in high school. What are, what are y'all doing? I, I'm now, every time I turn on the news, not every time I turn on, if I turn on the news, you seeing and hearing about school shootings. Parents, Reach out more to your children. Dig deeper to see what's going on with them. Not saying when they come through the door, oh, hey, honey, how was your day? Anything, oh, they say fine. Oh, it's cool with you. What's wrong with you? Dig deeper. Even when they get to the point where, oh, I, I don't want to talk to you. I hate you. Da, 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 da. With that, you have to take a prom, a, a calm approach. Find a way to, to actually break the ice with them, I guess. Um, uh, every parent has a method. Not one method gonna work for every body. It, it, that's not how this world works, man. And you can't read books about parenting. Cause let me tell you something. It's not about getting it right the first time is not trying to become the perfect parent. It is not a, a manual, a life manual on becoming the perfect parent. Like I said, parents are human beings too. Parents are imperfect human beings. So you're not going to get it right the first time. You're not going to uh have this bundle of joy when, when the first born or and that you'll get it right right then and there that you're gonna know everything about them before they even uh, reach adulthood just by looking in their eyes and their face while you're holding them it doesn't work that way man it takes time patience mistakes and past experiences, man. You learn from your parents. 
their parents' parents, and so on and so forth. The stories that your parents tell, your stories that your grandparents tell, the experiences they had went through. And it's not, it's not, there's nothing wrong with asking or, or getting advice of what should I do about my child acting out or whatever. Like I said, we're imperfect human beings, man. especially if we're parents. I know I am one. And I'll tell you, it's still hard, even though my children are grown. I know I don't look like <laughs> I should have grown children, but I do. And there's some, there are a lot of mistakes I've made. One thing I can say, one thing I can say is this. One, I'm um, very intelligent very kind and loving and patient and understanding and never for once thought about going to school shooting up students, teachers, principals so on and so forth it starts all starts at home man. take the time to actually connect with your children because one day you're not going to get that time back. And when you either, there's two places. And this is real. I'm not going to bite my tongue for y'all. Two places where your children going to wind up or your child. Grave or in prison. That's a choice. But you can't help with that choice to be on the right path where they don't have to choose the graveyard or prison. Choose life. But it all starts with you. Y'all might say, oh, I'm going off the edge. But since my hiatus, I had a lot of time to think and reevaluate my life. I had a lot of things to sort out. I had a lot of demons I was fighting. And I don't keep it real with y'all. There are some things I could not bear to manage on my own. Yeah, I was prideful. Yeah, you know. But I'm glad I did what I did. But I can't say it was all me. It's a man of stairs. See, that's what us adults need to instill and the youth today. I, I don't I don't know. And now I don't even know what's going on with the adults out here. They think him some I can't say all. Oh. Going out here. Try to make a name for themselves. I can understand you, you. You try to build a business, build a brand. But you have ethics. And you have standards. And you're going about the mature way of doing it. But you have people out here that hope they're going to start their own business by frauding people. robbing and stealing just to make that dollar it's not the way folks 
What has the world come to? Like I said, I must be old fashioned. Or oh, either I done woke up. Yeah, I was one of those people out there in the world. Not doing things just because. Certain things I was doing to survive. And some of the things that are major mistakes, I can't take them back. They're life lessons. But all this, I, where's corrupt, man? But once again, get back to, to the children. It all starts with you, the parent, or the parents. Love your kids while they're here, man. Try to protect them all you know how. Dig, scratch way below the surface, see what's wrong with them. Before you send them off to school, and one, you know, that next day, they decide to take lives. All because of what? You didn't take the time out to see what was going on with them. Instead, kids are the future in which they are, man. But it could be a negative or a positive effect. We need balance. Balance starts with you. Peace. Love y'all. I'm out.